what's up everyone danny lightning back with another csr2 video today we're going to talk about how to get parts for the prestige cup cars all right a lot of people ask this question and they have no idea how to get parts for these things you get a brand new car you're like hey i need to do the prestige cup but i don't have any parts so i'm not going to be able to finish it generally the game gives out enough parts to finish it so we're going to talk about a few ways you can go ahead and get free parts for this all right if you go into the rare imports and you click on the parts tab over here, you're going to see a prestige parts crate. That's going to be free every couple of days and that's going to give you some nice parts for your car. And if you want, you can spend some bronze keys. Generally, I don't have to spend the bronze keys, but you can if you need to guys, you can if you need to. So that's the first way to get some parts. We'll go talk about another way in just a second. If you enjoy this content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Hit that little bell and set those notifications to all. That way YouTube notifies you when I up upload something. If you're interested in joining my Discord, guys, there's a link to that and my other two YouTube channels in this video's description. At the very beginning of the season, there's going to be a showdown that's either going or starts right around the beginning. And that's going to give out some parts for the Prestige Cup. If you go over to the Pro Leagues thing, you click on that. Unfortunately, that showdown has already ended, so I can't show it to you. But, all right, there are, uh, there are parts for these cars in the showdowns. All right, so you're going to see the little Crew Cups and the Token Cups and all kinds of stuff like that pop up on the map. And all you got to do is come in here and do three races. Now, if you're in a crew... You have to be part of a crew though. So you and your you and your crew have to come in here and do these races. And I think your crew has to do a total of 50 of these. All right? It's it's three races, guys. It's three races. Everybody can take a second out of their day to come in here and do this. And the one that starts a couple days after the Prestige Cup car starts gives out a stage 6 part for the Prestige Cup car. So if you're if you're working on the Prestige Cup and you realize, "Hey, I'm stuck." Make sure you come in here and do this and make sure you let your crew know, hey, if they're not doing this, make sure you let them know. You guys need to go in there and race this so we get this free part for the Prestige Cup car. But it's unbelievably simple to come in here and simply just do three races. It'll take, you know, two, three, four minutes out of your day and ba bam free stage six part. I mean, you can't beat it, guys. You can't beat it. So now I just finished this race. When I go back to my garage, as long as me and my crew have finished enough of these, I'm going to go ahead and get that stage 6 part and install it on my car. And if I was stuck on the prestige cup, maybe that'll help me get through it. Next, we have our supply cups. These are designed just to give you parts for the prestige cup cars. And these pop up several times during the season. It stays for a few days. And then another one pops up, stays for a few days, and another one pops up. And for example, on this one, if I hit race number 15 on this, it's going to give me parts. Now, if I do race number five, I'm going to get some crew RP. And once I hit race number 25, I'm going to get more crew RP. So these are really great for getting RP for your crew, plus a couple parts for your car. So don't forget to do these. These are 25 races. So that one does take a minute, but totally worth it. And the next thing is the Prestige Cup. Now, this gives out parts for the car and the stage six. So you can get fusion parts and stage six parts just by racing the prestige cup so if you get far enough into this you're going to get some nice stuff for your car guys um i've already collected all the prizes from this so i can't show you what they were but that's basically the the main ways to get parts for your car now let's just say i get a brand new car that's just introduced into the game i don't have any parts for it at all as long as i upgrade that to stage five throw whatever stage six parts I get on from this stuff and all the fusions that I collect from the things I just showed you, that's usually enough for me to complete the entire prestige cup without spending any of my keys to get parts from the part crates. So I think that wraps this one up, guys. Those are the main ways to get parts for your prestige cup cars. Not much to it. It's really easy. All you got to do is do a few races here and there throughout the season and ba-bam, it's going to throw you some parts. And it's probably going to be enough to get you through the prestige cup that season. If not, well, you can go in there and spend the keys if you got some bronze keys. That's one of the reasons I'd say everybody needs to save their bronze keys. Generally, I try to save my bronze keys for when there's a car that I really like and I want to get parts for it and max it out. All right. Generally, that's what I save mine for. I try not to 
to uh, spend them on prestige cup cars, but you can if you need to, all right? If you're like, hey, I got to get this RP. I'm not going to make my cruise requirements. You might want to think about spending some of those keys. If you'll be okay without it, I would say don't spend the keys until you're trying to get a really cool car. Anyways, I think that wraps this video up, guys. Please remember to like and subscribe. Hit that little bell. Set those notifications to all. Don't forget to check out my Discord server and my other YouTube channels. Link to that in this video's description. All right? You guys are awesome. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Later, guys. Lightning out.